Hey guys, hope you're all having a great day. I'm out in the bush. Um, I'm at like around Hornsby, Goldston area um, in the Great North Walk. I haven't been this way before, but I used to, like, I've done this walk many times, but I haven't actually been this way, so it's really cool. And I found this really nice spot here, and there's like no one here, and yeah, it's really, uh, it's really nice. And anyway, if you're watching on YouTube, I haven't posted for a while on this health channel, so I'm kind of going to explain why I'm why I'm doing it now and what's happening. Basically, give you guys an update. Like, so if you're aware, I've got two channels. I'm also a musician, so I've been um, mainly focusing on music and producing my own songs whilst producing covers at the moment. So that's why I've been putting all my energy towards that YouTube channel and that part of my life rather than health even though I'm still like a big um, I'm still fruitarian I'm still really into health and being the best that you can be basically and so I still always go out in nature I just haven't been like talking to you guys as much um, because of that and because of, of a lot of changes have happened so I've just moved and all that and yeah so I felt like today I needed to say something so Firstly, um, before I get into any news, uh, this video is also about um, my blood test results, which I'm giving to you guys because I was actually shocked at the results after being a year fruitarian and getting a blood test and seeing the results. Um, they were quite um, not what I expected, in a good way, in a good way. Um, not perfect, but but good. Um, definitely better than they have been in the past, and considering the simplest the simplicity of my diet you most people would probably assume just from the general knowledge that has been put out there that I would be deficient in a lot of things uh, so basically the only things that I was deficient in was sodium so salt um, which is makes sense if you're eating mainly fruit so I eat 80% fruit and some vegetables mainly raw but I have been eating some cooked vegetables recently as well um, but still all simple so no additives no nothing else I don't um, like use anything else besides fruit veggies uh, I use a bit of cacao powder and like I drink tea and stuff but I don't um, have any stimulants of any kind or uh, any supplements and yeah sodium was low so that's easily fixed by just eating either more vegetables because vegetables have salt in or also adding salt to things so I may add some like Himalayan pink salt to my food now because of that to get up there um, however I'm not concerned about this and the other thing that was low was also iron so I am looking into eating more plant-based foods with iron in them even if they are from like even if I have to eat more veggie more vegetables or more cooked foods I haven't looked into it so yeah I'll do that um, if not, I can supplement, but I prefer not to supplement. And as I said, I haven't been supplementing anything. My B12 was normal, right? So it's like everybody in the vegan community says you have to take B12 if you're vegan. Like it's a really important nutrient and you, you only get it from the soil because um, we wash everything now and stuff that it doesn't, you won't get it anymore. But either I got it from that or got it from somewhere because my... B12 was fine, my protein was fine, all the other vitamins were fine, minerals were fine, and also a good news was that, like previously before, I've mentioned if um, briefly that I had a, 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 a liver problem, I don't know what the issue was exactly, but there was some, there was some issue there, which is probably because I do a lot of exercise and mainly because I used to drink. And if you drink, obviously if that's well known, that it's going to affect your liver. But if you do exercise as well on top of that, especially while you're drinking, well not not at the, literally at the same time, but um, that can put a strain on your liver and your kidneys, dehydrates you. And so that affected me in the past. And that has gotten significantly better since I've improved my diet. It got better as I went vegan, and it's gotten even better as I went fruitarian. So... I'm not out here to preach fruitarianism or veganism or raw veganism or anything, but I'm just telling you the results 
are doing well. So I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. And um, yeah, I'm feeling great. Like I don't feel sick at all. The only reason I go to the doctor once a year is just to get a blood test, to get everything checked. Because I don't know everything. I'm not a doctor. And you know, not many people are free training. So it, it, it's trial and error. You've got to um, try it. Nobody's perfect. And like you see some things, people in the raw food community, maybe you see them and they're maybe they're not their best in some way like for one diet is not the be all and end all of health and also like everybody is a work in progress in every area of their life like if you choose to focus on food and really get that right then maybe you know what you're doing a bit more than others or you focus on exercise more you focus on meditation more whatever but my point is there is no right or wrong it's just all learning and everybody has a different body because they've like got different genetics but they've also like been exposed to different things in the environment they need that's the reason why we need to not necessarily eat differently but just learn what we need to heal within our own body like if everybody was the same for birth and we didn't have any um destruction from genetics or from the environment or from like programming in our minds then we would be all the same so if i hope that that makes sense but, um, yeah, so I was really happy with my results. So I'm going to keep eating what I'm eating and just adding some salt and trying to increase my iron intake. And, yeah, I feel great. I went to the gym yesterday for the first time in three months. I felt stronger than ever, believe it or not. I went in there um, with the attitude that I'll just take it easy. I won't lift anything too heavy. But I was lifting the same as I did before when I was working at Hornsby. And, like, I was working at Arena too. And I was training pretty intensely. I wasn't training that intensely at Arena. But I was doing the same kind of workout that I would. Not the same workout. I was doing different, a bit of different exercises. Because um, I'm more into gymnastics now. So I do exercises to strengthen myself to do more handstands and those kind of movements. But, yeah, I was really surprised. So, yeah, I'm just saying this to you guys to, um, to let you know that, you know, try different things try different things that are outside the norm, you know, because you never know how it'll affect you. I definitely feel better. I would never go back to eating the way I did. Um, but I, like, I'm not, um, wanting to be restrictive either. So that's why I still eat some cooked foods, um, main, partly for social reasons, if I need to, because I don't, um, I don't want to isolate myself too much, like never go out to eat or anything like that, because there aren't that many fruitarians around my area or anywhere, really, unless you go to some tropical place. But yeah, so that's the news, and yeah, so I've been putting all my energy and time into music, so I haven't done anything on here, and I said in a previous video that I may completely not do any health stuff anymore, and I was planning to do that, and I'm not really focused on this, but I will still post videos on here, and I may move it all to my music channel. So, if you want to check out my music channel, I'm going to link that in below, so you can check that out, check out my music, but I'm also going to be integrating the health side as well, and just what I'm doing. So, I'll still have some videos where I just talk to you guys on there as well, and yeah, so it's all good, it's all awesome, I am enjoying life here and yeah so that's pretty much it i will see you guys in the next video ciao